guys and gals to my channel loader operator here and today we are back in ETS 2 for some career trucking um, so yeah let's just go let's go find us a nice heavy load to haul let's see here we are in Bremen and ooh, hey look at this this is a mod that I recently installed it's a uh, it's like bridge beams I guess so yeah Go over here to London, it looks like. Yep, London. So let's just go ahead. We'll take this load with our new truck here. Oh, you know what? I need to sleep first. <laughs> oh, there we go. Now, you know what? I bet it's not there no more. I did. I think I saw like four hours time on that thing. Um, yeah, it's gone. Damn. Well, let's take. Well, no, that's kind of a short one. <laughs> Bremen to Bremen? Yeah, I don't think so. That ain't going to help us out much. Um. Let's see here. Let's go ahead. We'll take this, uh, the front end. Nah. I don't know. <laughs> um, let's see here. 38.40. Well, let's just take this load of rye. Nah. What else we got? We got some cheese and some vinegar, milk, vinegar again. Hey, that goes kind of over into Poland. Uh, pet food. Uh, that's the front end loader. Tomatoes. And yeah, I'm not sure what this is. Um, <laughs> I just can't I, I, I don't know how to read that um, yeah let's just we'll go ahead we'll take the digger I mean it's not heavy enough we're gonna need uh, the drop axle for it but uh, anyway whoops uh, drive <laughs> I never adjusted my seat I noticed in the last episode so I need to do that. Uh, there we go. Go. I need to not be so close to the dashboard. <laughs> Oops. No. Wrong one. That one. There we go. Now. Got all that set up. Let's go pick up the load. In our new our new truck here should be fun to drive I think I definitely like you know these style of trucks they're pretty nice it's right in here according to the map Ooh. I like how you can hear everything like jostling around when you go over the speed bump. That's kind of nice. <laughs> and yep, we're taking the digger. Well, it's not a digger. It's a front end loader. But uh, they call it a digger on this game. I don't know why. Right through this hole. Now, in this particular area, I actually have to uh, come in kind of like this. So, that way I could get out again.
Anyway, we'll just get hooked up here. There we go. Turn our our beacons on. Let's see if we can't make it out of here without doing too much damage to anything. It's almost like the lights aren't on or something. <laughs> but they are, so... Alright. Get on with our journey here. It's going to be kind of a short one today, but... That's alright, you know. That's part of trucking. Sometimes you have short loads and sometimes you have long loads, so... See if we can get out of here. There we go. Not too bad. I like the steering on this truck. It's pretty nice. Pretty nice. And actually, you know what? I gotta do some more seat adjustments here. <laughs> go like that. There. I think I think that's better. Yes, I think that is better. Got a fuel tanker guy over there. Oh this is going to be fun. Ah, not too bad. Not too bad at all. Made it without hitting nothing, so doing pretty good. Now, this thing should have a full tank of fuel, because I just bought it, so shouldn't have to stop for fuel. Come on, Mr. Light. <laughs> Where is my fuel gauge anywhere? On here. Let's see here. Oh, there it is. I see it. Kind of right next to the steering wheel. You got the one under the steering wheel, and then just to the right of it is the fuel gauge. Dude, I got lots of fuel. My turbo boost gauge. It works. That's nice. Know, just for the hell of it <laughs> I might get up here on the other interstate and uh, uh, I might drop the lift axle just because I can just to I don't know just because I can <laughs> Down it goes. Boop, boop, boop. Yep, it's down. And it's awful loud out here. Got all my lights going. Kind of dark. Can't really see much, but... Uh, crap. No. Yeah, I just crashed into a car. Oh well. <laughs> That's what I get for looking at my truck instead of watching where I'm going. Now, 
Brights work. <laughs> All right, we don't need that down no more. I'll just bring it back up. Mm -hmm. There, I can see better. <laughs> Come on, slow down a little. There we go. My normal speed limit of 60. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. I'm coming through. <laughs> okay, I can't get off on the next one, so I need to stay in this lane. You know, I just got to thinking I should put maybe like an oversized load sign on the front of this, but I mean, I'm not always going to be hauling oversized. I mean, this is like over width maybe, but I don't think so because it looks like it's inside the trailer rails or inside the sides of the trailer, so... I don't know. It's just got a beacon on the trailer, so I turn the beacons on when the trailer has a beacon. <laughs> Hope you guys are enjoying your day. Had a pretty good day myself. I got one more day of loading boulders. And then we'll be off to, or go back, be able to go back to our other job. And, uh, crush some rock for, uh, a guy. That we do every couple of years or so, so. But we started on him this uh, spring and uh, yeah we just got so busy in our own gravel pit that we wasn't able to get back to finish the job over there so it sounds like starting next week I'm going to be going over there and uh, finish the crushing job that we have over there so that will be good Earn a little extra money that way, you know, so. Nobody's coming. Which is good, because I don't want to, you know, crash into another car like I did before. <laughs> Alright, cruise control resume. Brights on so I can see. Nope, turn them off. <laughs> All right, making pretty good time, I think. I tell you, I like the gauges in here. They're, you know, they're nice. Oops, sorry. <laughs> easy to see and read and yeah it's here the red one in the middle down there on the bottom that looks like the clock yeah that's the clock I see 12 3 6 9 and it's moving with the time so 
it's almost two o'clock in the morning. Woo! There we go. Excuse me, Mr. Concrete Guy. <laughs> Man, you really gotta look over that far to see the mirror. Get over in this lane again. So I can let all the people who want to go faster than me go. I'm sure it'll make them happy. So, yeah, I like this truck so far. You know, it's a good truck. It's kind of sad you can only get 600 horsepower engine in it, but, uh, hey, it does the job. You know, we're getting there 60 mile an hour, so doing pretty good. Uh, slowed down a little bit on a couple of the hills, but, you know, it's not like we slowed way down, so could have been worse, is what I'm trying to say. Come on, Mr. I don't know what that was. <laughs> I think it was a Porsche, but I'm not exactly sure. I didn't look at it good enough. That's an Audi. This is a Volvo. Well, at least according to the mud flaps. And yes, we got to exit up here, it looks like. Leash. Is that where I'm going? Leash? I am. How about that? <laughs> Slow down. You know, the Jake works pretty good on it, too. So, that's always nice. Have a nice, good working Jake. That actually slows you down when you need it to, you know. It's always nice. Alright, Mr. Yellow Car, you better get a move on. Right, cruise can resume. And we're getting close actually. We got 126 miles to go. And yeah, it, it, I mean, it struggles a little getting up the hills, but. I still think it's a good truck. I like the way it drives. Uh, yeah. You know, it's not like I'm in a big, ginormous hurry, so. I mean, like I said in one of my earlier videos, I like to get there early, but, you know. I try to, you know, get there earlier just in case something happens, you know. Because uh, so far... Since this new update, there's been a couple car accidents, you know, you had to stop and wait for, and, you know, little things like climbing that hill at 45 miles an hour, you know, you don't think that'd take off much time, but 
it does so or adds time yeah doesn't take any off it adds it because <laughs> you're going slower so parcel farce or force I think that's what it said something force <laughs> I just, I really like this truck. I mean, it's not going to become like my new ultimate favorite, you know. I think that's, it's always going to be that 389 I got right now. But, uh, you know, this one's a nice one to drive too. I like this one. It's not crazy on the horsepower like the 389, but... It gets the job done. So, yeah. I like it. <laughs> Gotta be getting close now. 90 miles. Seen a lot of Lee's shines, so. just you know I'm looking around at all my gauges making sure everything's working um, <laughs> I should be watching where I'm going but does the torque gauge work or is it because the boost gauge is moving but I don't know when I start slowing down I'll have to look over there at it and see if it uh, goes down any. Because it should, by rights, when I'm going downhill, there shouldn't be any torque. Like there, it should have dropped off a little bit, I think. But, uh, maybe not. Let's just test it real quick. Yeah, see, zero boost, and it still says I have all kinds of torque. But <laughs> nope, gotta stay here. I thought I had to get off there, but I don't. So we'll continue on the interstate. <laughs> just because I want to again. There. It should be down again. Yep. I can still, still steer pretty good. But, uh, uh, we'll see how it does when I get a, a big load on it. Of course, when I, you know, get to towns and stuff, I'll have to pick it up because I'm trying to make a right-hand turn with that many wheels on the ground. Yeah. Doesn't really help much, you know. That one is red, and that one is blue. 
Interesting. <laughs> I kind of wonder if maybe my TSM mod, or yeah, TSM, yeah, truck sim map isn't uh, properly installed or something, I don't know. Or maybe they all look like that. <laughs> I wouldn't think so, but hey. It could be a possibility, you know. Except for the excavator, I don't understand why that's, you know, bright red. But uh, okay, we are really close now. This is our exit, and it looks like we're coming into town. So. Just go ahead and raise that axle up. Alright, I gotta cheat here. Because this is pretty long vehicle, so. Don't you even think about trying to pass me. Oh, you jerk. Really? Here I am holding up traffic because one guy had to be, you know, super speedy man and try to beat me around the corner. There we go. <laughs> oh, I see. You know, some people and their children. <laughs> well, that light just turned off back there. 5.30 in the morning. All right. Now, if we can just make this corner. Without somebody trying to run us over. Yay, we made it. Now we gotta go in here. I think we'll just go ahead and we'll make a loop kind of like this. There we go. Not too bad. This thing turns pretty sharp too, you know. I wasn't even turning it all the way, so. Now let's see here, we turn here. Now, see if we can get this on the first try. I'm going to try to do it on the first try. Come on, concentrate. Nope, I ain't going to do it on the first try. <laughs> Maybe try number two. Oh yeah. That is nice. Try number two. No problem. No problem at all. Oops, too far. <laughs> I always go to the very back like that and then I slowly pull forward 
until it turns green because that's and look at that perfect all right so let's see here if you guys enjoyed the episode uh make sure to hit the like button down below and also don't forget to subscribe for more and uh we'll see you guys in the next one thanks for watching